Hi there, I am Sophia from InOrange. In this video, I will demonstrate how to enable SSO for your Slack application using the Mini Orange Identity Broker solution. Enabling single sign-on for your application allows the users to use a single set of credentials to log into various applications. This improves the security as well as the usability of the application. Though enabling SSO is the way to go, several challenges are faced during its implementation. One of the issues faced during the implementation is cross-protocol support. Your identity provider or user directory may not support the SSO protocol supported by your application. Many enterprises have their on-premises Active Directory or databases, which do not support OAuth, SAML, out-of-the-box. In such cases, enabling SSO for them using the traditional implementation can be a challenging task, and hence SSO is implemented using identity brokering solutions. Mini Orange Identity Brokering Solution enables you to connect an application with an identity provider that may support different protocols, and the integration is seamless. Mini Orange Identity Provider also provides a lot more flexibility and functionality on top of cross-protocol brokering. Now let's take a look at some additional features provided by the Mini Orange Identity Broker. Mini Orange provides the following features, which allow you to enable SSO for your Slack application using multiple identity providers. First login via domain mapping. Here Mini Orange selects the specified IDP or directory for an individual user to log in using the email domain entered by the user. Here when the user selects to log in via SSO in the Slack application, he is redirected to the Mini Orange page. Here he enters the credentials, which will intrinsically redirect the user to the specified identity provider. Next IDP selection feature, where the user is allowed to select the identity provider while logging in. Here when the user tries to log into the Slack application, then he is redirected to the Mini Orange, where the Mini Orange Identity Broker service allows your user to select one IDP from a list of identity providers that suits them or under which their identity is stored. This can be extended to include social login. Mini Orange allows end users to log into your Slack application using any non-enterprise social identity, such as Facebook, Twitter, Google, and many others. Next login via app identity provider mapping feature. Here you configure an application and an identity provider mapping. In presence of multiple identity providers, you can configure your Slack application to use any identity provider. Here all the logins for the application will always take place using the pre-specified identity provider. You can also change the look and feel of this page by customizing the title, logo, favicon, background, button color, and many more of the login page. Thus from this section, you have full control over the look and feel of the login or sign up page. End user portal dashboard customization, branding, internationalization, RTL support, vanity URL, and many more. In addition to brokering, Mini Orange offers a variety of other services including multi-factor authentication, adaptive authentication, and provisioning. In addition to brokering, multi-factor authentication can be used to secure access to your Slack application. Mini Orange supports over 15 different two-factor authentication methods, like OTP over SMS or email, SMS with link, Mini Orange push notifications, Google Authenticator, Microsoft Authenticator, Mini Orange Authenticator, hardware tokens, phone callback, and many more. The Mini Orange brokering system also supports dynamic attribute mapping, which enables you to specify user attributes in apps, utilizing attribute information from the identity providers. This allows your users to be bootstrapped into the application with all of the essential information, allowing them to use it seamlessly. This not only enables SSO to your application, but also further secures your application. This improves both the security and the usability to access different applications used in your enterprise. Mini Orange also offers adaptive authentication, which restricts access to various applications based on a variety of parameters. These could include your IP address, location, access time, and MAC addresses. You can create IP limitations by setting up a list of IP addresses to allow or deny access. Device-based access restrictions, where the admin allows end users to add a fixed number of devices as trusted devices for their account. 
location-based restrictions by configuring a list of locations where we want to allow end users to either log in or deny. And time-based access restrictions for your applications where admin configures a time zone with start and end time for that time zone and users are either allowed, denied or challenged based on the condition in the policy. Depending on your use case, Mini Orange provides both SSO and security to your Slack application. Mini Orange Identity Broker solution can be set up in many ways. Based on your use case, you can configure how you want to enable SSO for your Slack application. Along with SSO Mini Orange Identity also allows you to configure more security by providing features like MFA and adaptive authentication. To enjoy a seamless authentication experience and delegate all single sign-on requirements with a click of a button, please feel free to reach out to us by email or in the comment section below and we will get back to you at the earliest.